Hello, I'm Jeremy Johnson, aka JDog of CoinDaddy, and I'm here today to chat a bit about the CoinDaddy Asset Vending Machine service and to walk you through setting up a vending machine. So first, what exactly is an asset vending machine service? The asset vending machine service is a way for an asset owner to set up a vending machine to sell their counterparty or doge party asset tokens with a few simple steps. Using our easy to understand tools, the asset owner can control all aspects of the vending machine, including the coinvend.io URL, the title, description, images, minimum and maximum buy amounts, as well as accepted payment methods. The vending machine accepts thousands of cryptocurrencies, including Bitcoin, Litecoin, Dogecoin, as well as any counterparty or Doge party asset. In addition to being able to configure the vending machine, you're also able to use our simple reporting tools, which make it easier for you to search and view all of your vending machine transactions, as well as keep on top of your operating costs. So what is the cost for this service, you ask? To activate a vending machine, there is a one-time $5 activation fee. For the monthly operating costs, CoinDaddy charges a flat five cents per successful transaction, plus a small miner's fee in order to write the transaction to the blockchain. In addition, there is a $5 minimum for each vending machine that it was active in the previous month. CoinDaddy bills you once a month for the vending machine service, and you will have seven days to pay the invoice before your vending machine services are deactivated. In most cases, your vending machine service will cost you about $5 per month. Now let's get started setting up a vending machine. The first step in listing your asset vending and setting up your asset vending machine is to create a CoinDaddy account Verify your email address, log into your CoinDaddy account, and add your counterparty or Doge Party wallet addresses to your account. Once your wallet addresses are verified, your assets will be automatically loaded into your CoinDaddy account. Here you can see a list of the assets in my account and some buttons that let you access the various asset tools. To activate your vending machine, simply find the asset you're wanting to set up a vending machine for and click that activate button in the coin vend column. Once you click the activate button, you will see a page which tells you a bit more about the vending machine service and the operating costs. To continue activating your vending machine, you simply click add to cart like this. Here you can see that the activation cost is $5, and you can choose to pay with Bitcoin, Litecoin, or Dogecoin. Once you select your payment method and click check the Check Out Now button and pay the requested amount, you will be returned to, CoinDaddy, to the CoinDaddy site and your vending machine service will be activated. For the sake of speed, I've already activated the Grumpy Cat vending machine and set up some payment methods. So let's take a look at this in my assets list. Now instead of seeing an activate button in the CoinVen column, you see view and edit buttons. Let's go ahead and click the edit button to take a look at the vending machine tools. The first thing we here see here is a screen telling us that our vending machine has zero Grumpy Cat tokens to sell and asking us to send some Grumpy Cat to the address. Let's go ahead and send some Grumpy Cat to the address so our vending machine has some tokens to sell. Now we see a message indicating that our vending machine service is currently enabled. The first thing we want to do is pick a coin vend URL for our vending machine to live at, as well as a title for our vending machine and a brief description of what this vending machine is selling.
Once we are done editing our vending machine info, we just click the update button like this. In addition to entering some basic information on your vending machine, you can also upload an image to be displayed on your vending machine by simply moving your mouse over this CoinDaddy logo and clicking Change Photo and selecting a photo from your computer. Now that we have set up the basic vending machine, we need to set up some accepted payment methods so that the vending machine can start selling Grumpy Cat tokens. As you can see, I've already set up some payment methods, but let's go ahead and set up another one. Let's say we want to sell one Grumpy Cat token for $1 worth of Bitcoin. First, we select Bitcoin from the dropdown, then set the pegging to USD, enter $1 for the buy amount, and one for the sell amount. Finally, we enter an address where we would like the vending machine to send payments. Let's do that now. Here we see a message telling us that the payment method has been added and we can see the payment method we just created. Now let's set up another payment method to sell one Grumpy Cat token for 1,000 Folding Coin tokens. First, we will select Counterparty Asset in the Currency dropdown since Folding Coin is a counterparty asset. Next, we will enter the folding coin asset name, which is FLDC. Then enter 1,000 for the buy amount and one for the sell amount. Finally, we enter an address where we would like our payment sent. Once again, we see a message telling us that the payment method has been added and we can see the payment method in the payment methods list. In addition to setting up payment methods, you can set up minimum and maximum buy amounts for your vending machine to sell, as well as a low amount, which CoinDaddy uses to notify you when your vending machine gets low on tokens to sell. Now that we have set up the Grumpy Cat, Grumpy Cat vending machine and configured some payment methods, let's take a look at what the vending machine looks like by clicking the View Vending Machine button. Here we see our Grumpy Cat vending machine, complete with the title, description, and image we just uploaded. You can clearly see the amount of Grumpy Cat, Grumpy Cat that is available as well as the asset reputation information so potential buy buyers can see your asset reputation history. Finally, on the right, we see, see a buy Grumpy Cat box, which we can use to purchase Grumpy Cat. Let's go ahead and click the pay with dropdown and see what payment options are listed. As you can see, there are a bunch of different ways to purchase Grumpy Cat, including Bitcoin, Litecoin, Dogecoin, and some counterparty and Doge Party assets. Let's go ahead and select Bitcoin. Now that we have selected Bitcoin, you can see that the vending machine has calculated the cost and displays it to you in the cost box. Now let's enter the address we are going to pay from, the address we would like our Grumpy Cat, grumpy cat delivered to, and our email address.
Here we see the vending machine asking us to send some BTC or Bitcoin to an address. At this point, users just follow the directions and pay for their order. And the vending machine will take care of sending one grumpy cat to the user once the order is complete. Now let's take a quick look at the CoinVent reporting tools, which you can use to search all of your vending machine orders and deposits, as well as see a breakdown of your operating costs. To get to the CoinVen reporting tools, you just click the My Account and then click My CoinVens like this. Here you can see a list of the vending machine orders and deposits across all of your vending machines, including the Grumpy Cat vending machine. To view information on a specific item, you just click the View button like this. Here we can see the full details on the vending machine order, including status, addresses, blockchain transaction hashes, pegging, conversion rate, USD price, and email address. This allows you to see exactly what is going on with your vending machine orders at all times, or at all times. Now let's go back and take a look at the boxes to the right. Here you can see a box which allows you to search for orders by date range as well as order status. Below the search box we see a quick stats box which shows you the current cost to operate your vending machine for a given date range. This will allow you to stay on top of your asset vending machine operating costs. So that is how you can use the CoinDaddy Asset Vending Machine service to set up a vending machine to sell your asset tokens. If you have any questions or want to learn more, please visit the CoinDaddy website at coindaddy.io. Thank you for your time.